Welcome back again. Matt Roloff runs a successful business and stars on a successful reality show, one that has been on the air for over a decade. It is therefore safe to assume that the little people big world patriarch is doing just fine for himself financially. But just how fine is a question that continues to be asked by fans of this TLC series. Viewers are understandably curious about the bank account of someone such as Matt, who they have been watching and following for years and years and years. So, just what is Roloff's net worth? We've done our best to discern this answer. First, let's start with his salary. In late 2018, Terence Michael, a reality TV producer, told E! News that he thinks TLC has a budget of between $250,000 to $400,000 for Little People Big World. He added that the families of shows such as these earn about 10% of that budget each week, which would mean a maximum of $40,000 per episode for the Roloffs. Second, for all the Roloffs, that is. We have no idea how the main cast members divvy up this cut, but there are now four adult lead stars, Matt, Amy, Zuck and Tori. So if we assume they do it evenly, Matt earns about $10,000 per episode. 3. For the record. That is pocket change when compared to, let's say, members of the Real Housewives franchise. Some of those women earn well into the six figures per episode. 4. How much did Matt earn before this show? We don't know. But in the late 80s, he worked as a computer programmer for well-known companies in Silicon Valley. In 1990, he and Amy decided they wanted a less hectic place to raise their family. And so Matt took a job with Sequent Computer Systems in Oregon. That same year, they bought the property that would eventually become Roloff Farms. 5. Let's also remember his impressive collection of books. In 1999, Matt wrote against tall odds, being a David in a Goliath world. How incredible of a throwback photo is that cover of the book? 6. Fast forward 8 years and… In 2007, he co-authored Little Family Big Values, Lessons in Love, Respect and Understanding for Families of Any Size. Again, look at that cover. 7. For the Kiddos Finally, most recently, he made the foray into children's literature with Little Lucy Big Race, which was released on May 17, 2018. It sold very well and he still promotes the book to this day. 8. It almost all comes down to the farm, though. Amy and Matt purchased their 34-acre farm in Helvetia, Oregon back in 1990, as noted previously. When they first bought it, the property consisted of a beat-up old farmhouse, a broken-down barn and an overgrown peach orchard, according to the Roloff Farms website. 9. Now, however. Today, the farm not only serves as the backdrop for the family's TLC program, but has also expanded to over 100 acres and is a successful agricultural business, event venue and major tourist destination during pumpkin season. This same website reads, the property also is home to a soccer field, in-ground pool and event venues as mentioned. 10. Did you also know that Matt serves as a motivational speaker? Roloff often gives motivational speeches for corporations or universities. His speeches typically cover inclusion, overcoming the odds and leadership. 11. Any other business interests? Matt also serves as the president of the Coalition of Dwarf Advocacy, a non-profit organization. Moreover, he established Direct Access Solutions, which sells a short stature accessibility kit to huddle chains to ensure a safe stay. 12. Any real estate On June 25, 2019, according to Oregon Property Records, Matt bought a portion of his ex-wife's farmland for $667,000. This means he earns more from the activities on the farm than he did prior to the sale. 13. There's also the home in Arizona. Matt purchased this vacation residence in 2018 for $375,000. It has two bedrooms and two and a half bathrooms. 14. So, where does this leave him overall? 
between the book sales, speaker fees, TLC salary and farm revenue, multiple outlets estimate Matt Roloff to have a net worth of $4.5 million. Not too shabby, right? 15. And by coincidence? Or maybe not a coincidence, since they agreed to split all farm revenue and, we believe, all TV show revenue 50-50, Amy Roloff is estimated to possess the same net worth. Sounds like a financially successful divorce to us.